Scrooge climbed into his bed, reflecting on Marley's words as he lay shaking with terror. He anxiously awaited the ghost's arrival, morbidly curious of what they might show him. Marley said three ghosts will visit me tonight. Who could they be? Maybe Dusclops? Or Gengar? Spiritum? It almost feels like they're already here. Ah! Wait, Coco! This isn't your scene! Did you read the script? I ain't script! Wait, Coco! I am the ghost of Christmas past. Hop into my magic box to see your past. How does it work? Magic. What stops time and space from collapsing on us? Magic. How do you know it's safe? Magic. I want off. First, we'll see your childhood Christmases. You mostly spent them playing video games. A lot of video games. Any thoughts? I wish I still had that much time for video games. Next. Ooh, Christmas with your first love. Oh no! My love, I need to talk to you. I need to postpone our wedding. What? You think I've been corrupted by greed and you don't love me anymore? At least you two were good at communicating. I wanna go home. Next will be the ghost of Christmas present. What was that noise? Hide my chair! Stop chewing the scenery! Are you here to teach me about Christmas? Maybe take me on a Christmas journey? Help me learn to embrace the holiday season? Are we going to do anything after food? The ghost took Scrooge to see how the Cratchits spend Christmas. Is it present time? Is it present time? Now, now, kids, you know the rules. You're not allowed to open your presents until the next morning. Can we now? How about now? They're so cute. Look, he's sick and still does his very best. <laughs> Let's sing. Fa la 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 la. This family is so precious. <laughs> if anything bad happens to them, I'll be devastated. I'm 